Tower Bridge to your left, we're going right across it. Victorian Bridge, it is actually made of uh, cast iron <coughs> with stone cladding. And there's the gurgling. Oh, it looks like a perfect uh, stone bridge, uh, not it's cast iron. What do you call that door? It's just a nickname they give us. It's like full of officers in there. And the two halves of the bridge which lift up to allow shipping to go through are called bascules. They used to be uh, hydraulic but now they're worked by um, pneumatic. In a good view of the city there and the Barbican, or the Gherkin as it's called locally. <coughs> Fortunately the tower's clad in scaffolding by the looks of things. Just as we go across the River Thames down to your left hand side, the Second World War cruiser, HMS Belfast, been there for years. It looks like a cruise ship alongside it and all, that's unusual because the first time I've seen them in the city. Silver Cloud. The entrance just down to your left hand side of the tower on the River Thames is called Traitor's Gate for obvious reasons. The tower of course has been many things in its uh, time. A royal palace, a jail, very, very famous people in jail there. And during the Second World War, it held the Grey Twins, would you believe? But they uh, escaped um, conscription. They wouldn't sign up, so they were put in the tower. But this is where uh, Henry VIII held all his wives before he chopped their heads off. And he did that on what they call Tower Green, which is this bit of grass down to our left-hand side in a minute. Here coming into view, that's Tower Green down to your left-hand side. <laughs> Building over to the right-hand side, either side of the traffic lights, is the Royal Mint. It's the administration uh, offices of the uh, Royal Mint. The, the money is now minted uh, up by Milton Keynes, I believe.